Okay. Probably, he's probably going to be back, let's be honest. Spark is a uh, methodical player, to say the least. Yeah, I would expect you to say that as an IC player. Yeah. Uh, I have watched the VODs. Yes. Okay, so, uh, Shroon versus Spark, Marth versus Sheik. This matchup, dude, sucks to be in the air above your opponent, sucks to be in the corner. That's basically the theme of this matchup. Exactly. Oh my god, that turnaround was and so good. the punishes good. are hard and very percent specific. Um, I didn't know that worked. Yeah, um, when you get hit by a move like up and you all, and when melee, when you get hit, you are turned towards your opponent. And uh, he got up and he was behind him, so he got turned towards the ledge, and he grabbed first. Wow. But yeah, as I was saying, very percent specific punishes. Um, but depending on the literal exact percent, up throw will combo for Marth or not. And same thing with Sheik, she wants to walk forward up tilt to chain grab, and uh, that's very dependent on specific DI. And right. we got a two stock lead for Spark. Spark saying, go back to your main, friend. But I think uh, I think Shroom usually asks for no chain grabs, which also might be why. It's oh yeah, I'm sure that's the reason. Yeah. Uh, and Spark's job to, you know, force him to go chic at those chain grabs online. Yeah, exactly. Oh, beautiful crouch wow. cancel. That was actually so impressive. Yeah. Okay, gets out of it with the get up attack. Very smart. True. Much like in the Rocky set, his punish game not looking super precise. Uh, but his neutral looking good. He just needs to come out of this deficit that Spark has built. Uh, yeah. Very nice attack by Spark. Wow. Yeah, he cannot close out the stock, and Spark's neutral has been very excellent so far. Up oh, straight up. A yeah. little bit of Laudandus recovery right there, mixing up which direction he's going to go. Ah. Uh, a little bit more difficult on this stage, not as free as Yoshi's or Pokemon. Yeah, okay. Oh, Spark, you saw he went for the fair down there. He that went for been it all. Incredible. He knows that if he gets that, this game is basically over, and Set Shroom still has a fighting chance while very behind. Oh, reads the spot dodge. Going for the quick kill. Gonna read the air dodge and take the percent. Oh, up yeah, tilt the forward air, yeah. Bread and butter. That's Sheik's specialty. Got those quick kill confirms. Like you were saying, Spark's kind of saying, go back to your main. Yeah. I mean, this is very, very impressive. Uh, also, like, yeah, I, uh, I feel like in the current year, you really got to not let Sheik strike the battlefield. I really like going to Fountain in this matchup. Right. And uh, I think it's showing why Spark looks so comfortable. I mean, like, not even like the stage super favors Sheik, but like, Spark is nice and comfy on battlefield. Oh, and no tipper. Yeah. Maybe he lost confidence after that first one missed. And exactly. again, a lack of a good edge guard. And Spark running away with this game. Looks like Shroom did not make the right choice. That's gonna be a clean three stock. Now he's wow. got a decision to make. So like, what kind of just like what happens? Here? So do you go? If I go Sheik, can we turn Chain Grab? Chain grab it's like, it's like a it's a big uh, conversation. Exactly, that's the thing. Yeah, yeah. Like there will be no Chain Grabs off. Spark knows, and so he says, "Okay, I wonder if Shroom." Like, because that's the thing. Like Chain Grabbing actually Sheik though at low percent is very not easy. Yeah. Uh, at zero, it's basically frame perfect, and you see a mistake right there from Shroom. Uh, at high percent, it is pretty easy. Um, and the punish game is pretty precise, but again, Shroom misses two chain grabs, you see him shaking his head. He's gonna DI off stage, get fared. But this is bread and butter. Wow, and he's just gonna do it again and again and again. And if Shroom's not hitting these chain grabs, he's gonna have to win this one in a long fought battle. It's gonna be so much harder for him. And that's the, uh, the edge guard. Oh, gets the reverse snare. Yeah, um, slide off the eyes. Or yeah. It's very powerful, so is Ops teching in this matchup because yeah. all the moves send a very low trajectory. Uh, actually, what you'll see a lot of Sheiks do is just grab and back throw and just right. do it over and over again just because they don't want to, they want to just completely avoid that situation. Absolutely. Uh, yeah, Spark flexing his F tilt. He's been using his anti air in the first two games. It's been working very well. Wow. And just putting together this combo, lots of pressure. Outspacing Shroom very hard right now, and honestly, like, it's hard to believe that that uh, Spark is the white sheep. I mean, like, yeah, he like, is actually completely destroying Shroom in these first two like, games. Oh, uh, and oh, you know, sometimes you're winning by too much. You know, gotta give your opponent a little bit back. Control your own uh, ego. Oh my gosh, these two are just kind of like dancing around the ledge. Yeah. 
And they're both respecting each other a lot, right? Lots of roll-ups, they're not like checking each other. Like we said in previous sets, Battlefield's scary, dude. You get slapped into the stage, you die, it kind of gives you some discipline. Exactly. And well, did you see that mash? One pummel at 107. What? You gotta buffer like, that. What? That was to. insane. I have never seen a one pummel mash at over 100, like ever in my life. I think, what is it? It's like three are guaranteed at this one. Or two. Dude, I don't know. I just I just saw like I saw what I didn't want to see. Exactly. So some Mario Party stuff. Now Shroom trying to get back to this game in a similar position to last game. Perhaps the character wasn't the problem. And dude, again we're on Battlefield and Spark looks real comfy. Oh, Phantom. And, oh, but Shroom keeps going. The Phantom was just extra percent. <laughs> Wow, oh, this jab, is jab. a nice, nice string by Shrooms, and then how are we going to edge guard? Yeah, Shroom, wow, did you see that? I, I'm just like so astonished right now, dude, Spark is doing some crazy stuff. But I don't maybe know if Shroom, get back from this. Yeah, Shroom might have figured something out. He's got to roll up in that spot. Yeah. And uh, Spark's going to attack on a little bit of percent, misses the jab there. Oh my god, that could have been a grab. That could have been literally the stock. Yeah. If he gets a grab here, he might not even need it at this point. Man, for Shroom, it's just like, his punish game not being perfect because what's plaguing him. And cannot get the hit, so Shroom will stay at 45, but Crouch Cancel is gone, which is huge in this matchup. Exactly. When one can crouch and the other can't, it's just different. Oh different my god, the pressure, dude. Late nares. Uh, very ambiguous whether or not you're going to late nair a tomahawk, so like, it's super powerful. The animation is almost the same until you hit the ground. Yeah, again, these two respecting each other a lot on the ledge. Shroom gonna get the chain grab. How far can he execute it? Not very far. Just not very comfortable in that environment. The whiff grab and all of a sudden he's just back off stage. Rinse and repeat fares. This honestly just should be the stock. It's gonna yeah. take him a few edge guards, but it's not too difficult. And oh, okay. Went straight to the ledge. And uh, he lives to fight another day. Until now. Yeah. <laughs> Same that day, day. That day went quick. Yeah, it was a very fast day. Are we gonna chain grab? No. No, it goes to the up tilt. Just I think Shroom made a conscious decision. He's like, I am better at just not chain grabbing. I'm just gonna, you know, make this one happen. Yeah. It's also at 80%, so there's really only one more grab anyway, so. Right, that's not really missing much. Oh, F tilt, F tilt, oh, no. and Shroom. SPs. Very Two zero Spark. Who was expecting this? I think Spark. Yeah. You know, Spark might have expected it. Got Trafasia and Absent Page playing Behind over us, there. S Fat is up 2 1 on Axe. Yeah, Trafasia, Absent Page on another recording setup. Got a lot of good sets. Army. Army and Chuda. Oh, I wish we had the Ditto on ours. It'll be close by. Yeah. And you can always watch the VODs later. I know, I know. Thank Shut us to the cancel grab, and that is so brutal. Shroom shucks his head like. Sorry, they're trying. They're trying. They're trying to commentate the ditto. Just yeah. remember, I was giving yeah. a this kid uh, credit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this kid trying to slide into those DMs. Ask him. Ask him. If they went here, you could take my spot. In. But I mean, it, I mean, this is game three. Yeah. This. This is game three. Yeah. Okay. Th this is game three. So. Sorry, sorry, anyone watching this? Yeah, we're, we're trying to sort something out. Sorry, Spark. I, I feel like he's a guy that watches his vods, <laughs> which is a good I, habit. I, I, if he's a, if he's anywhere decent, like literally every player I've talked to just beats commentary. So it's like you know, uh, right? He's probably point. got it off. Hey, Spark, if you're listening, uh, you're playing sick. Yeah, oh my goodness, you're very impressive. You're playing very sick. A lot more impressive than I expected, which doesn't mean much from a random, but like good stuff. And the grabs, dude. No chain grab. Both of them flubbing a bit now. You know, you gotta think it's it's Spark's moment. Yeah. And uh, how can he compose himself? He's got three games. He needs to take one. Let's see. Just starting up that combo. We're seeing here. Ah, not spacing correctly. He actually got the read on Spark shield dropping, but could not convert. Also, it looks like uh, Army and Judad are not going to wait for us. Yeah, Judad's looking at him with this blank stare. Like, really, dude? I want to play melee. Oh my goodness! Wow, nice. Dash attacks uh, up B or up air. Very nice. And dude, the ASDI down saving him. Sparks got a lot of little tricks. 
is really making it hard for Shrew, who's already had a tough time comboing. Uh, like, he's just doing a lot of stuff that's really annoying, and this could be the chain grab. And, oh, it mashes out. Yeah, Very smart. Um, I think that Spark was trying to squeeze in some pummels because UDI out there, and it basically ends. So, oh no! Uh, that's dude, this is crazy, and Spark is smiling. He's like, oh, too bad, dude, on the outside. But on the inside, he's like, yes! Yeah, that, was, mine. that was a big smile, too bad. And with Shroom not chain grabbing very well, he's got a long road, and Spark just needs a grab. Shroom finds the grab, goes to the chain grab, doesn't get it. Yeah. More important than the reaction at that percent is just getting the frame one dash. Yeah. He's not been getting it. Okay. Oh my goodness. He just could not put anything nothing. together. Dude, two grabs and he did like nothing. And Spark spacing is too good right now, man. It is a good sign from Shroom that he's like finding the grabs. So yeah, it's a good it's a good sign for the future. It just not but if doesn't I'm the, look like it's today. If I'm Spark, I'm not even that worried about getting grabbed. You know, like I'm okay with getting grabbed right now. I'd honestly rather get grabbed than F tilted because Shroom is just not converting. But last stock, can Shroom bring it back? Oh, he reads the jump, but gives Shroom the ledge. A little bit of a mistake in the movement. Spark trying to get the needle turnaround, gets the back air. Is Shroom going to ledge? No, he smartly goes Reverse up. fair. Is that just... Nope. Oh, he read for the read. Spark jabbing, doesn't grab. Shroom rolling all over the place. <laughs> wow, nice movement but from Spark. That's just it. Just run yep, up down smash. Down smash and Spark, Spark takes three, a three. Oh. Oh. I don't know how that happens in region, but at a national, that is a big deal. Is Spark is going to move into top 24? I believe so. Wow. wow. Okay, so Spark on the run. That was very impressive. Ginger Lod is game five.